In this question, we have to calculate the speed of the wave. Before going into the calculations, let's analyze and understand the diagram. You can think of a distance displacement graph of a wave as a photograph of the wave at a given point in time. This model is not exactly accurate in this question since we have a longitudinal wave, but we can still use this model to answer some of the question parts. Using this idea then, we can think about the solid line on the diagram as the photograph of the wave at t equals zero and of the dotted line as a photograph of the wave at t equals 0.882 milliseconds. The horizontal distance between the solid line and a dotted line then gives us the distance traveled by the wave in 0.882 milliseconds. Looking at the diagram, we can see that this distance is equal to 0.3 meters. This is the horizontal distance between, for example, the maximum point of the solid line at 1.2 and the maximum point of the dotted line at 1.5. The time between these two positions of the wave, as we said, is given to be 0.882 milliseconds, which I can change into seconds by using this conversion from the metric multiplier section of the data booklet, giving me 0.882 times 10 to the power of negative 3 seconds. To calculate the speed of the wave, now we simply have to divide the distance traveled by the time it has taken the wave to travel this distance. So we get V, speed, is equal to 0 0.3 divided by 0 0.882 times 10 to the power of negative 3, which gives us approximately 340 meters per second.